Hey everybody, welcome. Uh, not long ago, I did a review of the Dungeon Works Red Oak Dice Tower, and uh, I was well, I was quite pleased with it. And uh, not long after posting my review, uh, Daryl over at Dungeon Works was kind enough to send along one of his other products. It is the seven-inch Red Oak Dice Tray, and. Uh, I've been using it in my latest uh, latest game that I've been working on, and uh, I thought I'd go ahead and uh, round out my Dungeon Works reviews with a review of the Red Oak 7-inch dice tray. So uh, why don't we just go ahead and have a look? So here is the Dungeon Works 7-inch uh, dice tray, Red Oak dice tray. Uh, construction is pretty similar to the Red Oak dice tower. It's a uh, good hard wood, and like the dice tower, it is also lined with high-density foam to keep things nice and quiet. Um, on the bottom, they've got the nice rubber feet to keep it from sliding around on your table. Um, good quality dice tray. It is as advertised, 7 inches by 7 inches. Uh, inside measurements for your actual dice rolling is not quite 6 by 6 inches. So about 36 square inches of total rolling area for your dice. It performs quite well. I like using my my special custom made dice rolling cup made by my daughter and uh, keeps my dice rolls contained. As you can see it works quite well. Even with larger dice And of course, also with polyhedrals. Good solid dice tray. Keeps things nice and quiet. That was my fault. <laughs> Got a little crazy with my roll and one jumped out on me. Yeah, good quality dice tray. I'm happy with it. One thing I'd like to throw in and perhaps this is cheating just a bit, but if you already own the Dungeon Works Dice Tower, I've found that the 7-inch dice tray makes a wonderful larger base for your dice tower to give your dice a little extra room to roll around. So now I have options if I'm traveling or I want a smaller footprint I can use my original mini dice tray with my dice tower, or if I want more room for my dice to roll around and a little bit more room for my hands to dig dice out, I can use it with my 7 inch red oak dice tray. I should also mention that you can order either the dice tray or the Dungeon Works dice tower in your choice of colors for the high density foam. So it gives you a little bit of customization option there. So I think that's going to round out my accessory reviews for a while. Um, that's the Red Oak dice tray, 7-inch dice tray by Dungeon Works. Um, I was quite happy with it. Uh, in between the dice tray and my Dungeon Works Red Oak dice tower, uh, I think that's probably going to fulfill my dice rolling needs for the foreseeable future in fine style. Uh, Daryl, thank you very much for sending this along. Uh, it's complemented my games quite nicely, sped things up quite nicely. Um, so yeah, if you're in the market for either a new dice tray or a dice tower, um, I hope you'll click on the link to Dungeon Works that I'll be providing down in the video description. Um, Oh, yes, and uh, this is $15, uh, 
on the Dungeon Works website, and that is uh, shipping included. So, uh, yeah, um, you know, I don't think you can go wrong with either one of these accessories. Uh, they, they both work just the way they're designed to. They're good, they're sturdy. Uh, good workhorse dice rolling accessories. Uh, they really come in handy, especially with our more dice heavy war games. Uh, it speeds things up quite a bit, keeps things contained. I'm really happy with them both. So uh, that's going to be it for today. Thank you for joining me. And uh, join me for my next game review, which will be coming up probably the same day as I upload this video. So uh, until next time, happy gaming.